WVTM 13's Magdala Lussant. Felton Jackson is tired of seeing piles of trash sit untouched in his Center Point neighborhood. We uh, have quite issues with uh, citizens moving in the area who don't want to keep up the property, uh, making your property look bad. Uh, leaves, uh, we have an issue with the uh, trash pickup. Down the road from Jackson's home is a pile of trash. There are three mattresses here and some cardboard boxes. There's no telling how long it's been here, but it's piles like this that make it an eyesore for Jackson. I uh, try to keep my property, you know, presentable, you know, that uh, uh, it may show a positive influence in the neighborhood. But you have many that don't want to, you know, do that. Jackson, so frustrated, he wants City Council and Mayor Bobby Scott to step in. It's their job to uh, uphold the ordinances and stuff, so that's what I look for. Everybody wants to come home to a clean neighborhood, and it's really taxing on the city's resources to, you know, constantly have to uh, pick up garbage and debris along our streets. Scott says COVID and low staff put them behind with collecting trash. He says it's up to homeowners or landlords to have garbage picked up. Calling in and signing up for it is up to each resident. Uh, the, there is an ordinance that the primary responsibility is of the homeowner. Inoperable cars that appear to be abandoned or neglected is another issue across the city. In recent weeks, Scott says code enforcers have towed at least 15 cars. Enforcement on that type of thing is kind of difficult. Uh, we can we do cite vehicles for being inoperable in the front yard on the grass. Uh, we give a certain amount of days before those vehicles are towed. Back in Jackson's neighborhood, he wants to see results soon. Are you uh, hopeful that something will be done soon? Well, I see it like this. It's not done. I just continue to go back, you know, until we see a change. In Centerpoint, Magdala Lusant, WVTM 13. In Elmore,